some time ago, I think it was in the late 90s, uh, we made a show called Pleasure, and uh, the starting point for that show was uh, an old vinyl record that I picked up in a charity shop. It was actually big band music from the 40s, Billy Cotton or something. We turned down the speed of the record, so uh, it was all slowed down. And it kind of set the tone for this piece, Pleasure, which began to feel very slow and subterranean and like time was being stretched. I guess the audience had to slow down for the piece as well. And one of the things that happened in the middle of the show was that we stilled the mix of events on stage down to something where really nothing was happening but thinking. And it was this little section where Richard asked me uh, why modern life was rubbish. But he asked it as a multiple choice question. And I think there were four potential answers. I can't remember what they were, but they were all impossible. And I was standing in between the curtains in a bra and knickers. I had a glass filled with water on my head. And Richard was blindfolded blindfolded <laughs> and he had a gun pointing at the glass and there was this period of time where I was just thinking about the answers and I always really really enjoyed this moment in the show because I would look out at the audience and I actually was wearing glasses uh, we all were we were wearing glasses that we'd found in a charity shop and I couldn't really see through the lenses but I was looking out at the audience and I was just thinking and looking and they were just thinking and looking and although the staging or the, of the image was incredibly kind of tense with the gun and the glass and the difficult question, the moment itself was really quite relaxed. And it kind of interested me that there were these two strains or tracks of thinking, the audience thinking and my thinking, uh, which of course is what happens all the time uh, in all of the shows. One of the things that we like to, to make space for is the drift of the audience where they bring their own thoughts to what's happening on stage.